gonna need red beef today? No, where do you get that? Where do you get the beef? Is it from Alberta or from... I'm not sure. Like, um, if you ask about the company that delivered the beef, then it's like a two sister poultry, which is somewhere in Wannabe, but not exactly know where the beef comes from. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Are you recording? <laughs> Yeah, I recorded that. <laughs> it's good, believe me, I haven't. No, I don't really care, though. But whatever. <laughs> I'll try the rare... Is it P2, the, the big one? Yeah, the rare bear. They, they cook in the shrimp, though. It's not yeah. rare, rare, rare. I know, that's yeah. what we're trying to explain to him. Oh, yeah. Okay, he's, he's all scared to try the rare beef, and I'm like, it cooks in this. See, see this, look at this stuff on see the See how rare it is? Is, is, is it, it completely raw or no? no. It's, it's, it's almost like a like a rare to a medium yeah, rare right now. Yeah, you see the other beef. It's already completely raw. Okay, look at the bottom. Stuff on the bottom over there. Yeah. If we just kind of pile the noodles yeah. on top of it. Yeah, yeah. It's, 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 it's okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's because it's thinly sliced that it can't. Yeah, it's like it's. Well, if you beef cooks that, really quickly. If you threw that in a pan, you do like a hot pan. It would be like flipped. It already like, be flipped. Yeah. 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 Yeah, they, they make it thin, so they it's don't like use that much of it. It's super thin, like stir-fried. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, it's not fried. It's already cooked. <laughs> it's already cooked. Yeah, yeah it's cooked. Yeah. Yeah. So that, according to the flip, is about 40 seconds. Yeah. Oh, you measured it? Okay. Well, I'm recording, so then... <laughs> so, voila, it's no longer rare, right? Yeah. yeah. It's, it's probably too hard to eat still, but... Yeah. Yeah. But it's cooked. It's kind of a big piece, is it? Well, there's big... Well, they kind of stick together a bit. Stick together if you don't want Yeah. We'll fall apart a bit. Vance and rare beef. <laughs> yeah, I've never had it before. It tastes... I had the raw beef a long time ago. But... Well, it's not raw. It, it, it's cooked now. Yeah. It's but definitely cooked now, yeah. I had the tart to yeah. beef, right? Like, it, it was raw. But if you, get, if you get the faux the beef, it's like it's falling apart the company and it's dry. It tastes like normal. It's, it's a little bit dry. This is like a yeah. yeah. But they cook the fat out of it too, right? But they cook it, which is good, I guess. But don't they? Uh, Not really, because I, I, I think the, the, the well done cuts aren't as good as the, the rare cuts. I know there's well, the, when, they have, what, like, well, when when it's when it's well oh, well done it's easier to hide it. When it's well done it's easier to hide uh, inconsistencies. And here's mine, which is well, basically the same thing except I have tried. <laughs> so come go. Yeah, for uh, uh, for excellent value and a great time, uh, a great family outing, try come go on Alexandria. <laughs> <laughs> It's a, on, but honestly speaking, I honestly don't think you can get better value than that place. But I, I haven't seen a cheaper restaurant in <laughs> I could, okay, I mean, you all know I could eat a lot. For like 10 bucks, I could probably eat, get full, and have leftovers. So, yeah, that's uh, Kondo in Alexandria. Yeah. <laughs> I've actually been there uh, a few times, and... One of my favorite things to order there, and there's always way too much food, is the mixed grill. And it's 15, 16 dollars. And you get a soup, a salad, a dessert, a drink, and your main has like six different kinds of meat, like a chicken cutlet, a pork mm -hmm. cutlet, a beef cutlet, a hot dog. It's, 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 t it's actually 11, uh, 10 95 Is it 10 95 It's 10 <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and it comes with like spaghetti and rice and or salad. Your choice, yeah, it's yeah. your choice. But well, my, my particular favorite is the baked pork chop on rice. You get a big, huge Pyrex pie plate full of fried rice, topped with like who knows how many pork chops, and then topped off with this really eerie, I'm not sure what kind of sauce it is. It's a tomatoey, cheese whizzy type of sauce. <laughs> with frozen vegetables. Yeah, anyway. And again, it comes with soup, it comes with salad, it comes with a drink. Oh, uh, it's for my burger. Um, so anyway, yeah, I don't know what's in it, but it, it, tastes, it tastes really good. So, um, yeah. Uh, to the western, to the western audience out there, it might seem a bit strange because you're walking in and you expect a, a restaurant to be a certain way. This is really the Chinese interpretation of Western style fine dining. So, and it's done quite badly, but they, they deliver on the they, they deliver on the quantity over quality side of it. So, yeah, so check.